What's cooking everyone? Welcome back to Lou's Food Reviews. Today, we're at Chipotle. Chipotle. <clears throat> Today, we're at Chipotle. And, you know, we've got just a standard, regular bowl. That's all we've got today. And in this bowl, there's white rice, corn, cheese, chicken, black beans, lettuce, and hot sauce. So, pretty standard stuff. And yeah, this was a bit on the steep side. This clocked in at around 15 bucks. I did get double protein chicken. You know, people these days, they're always saying that Chipotle, they skimp out on the, the portion sizes, especially the protein, right? So, I guess we'll find out. Now, we did get the double protein, but I could see as they were scooping the protein into the bowl that they they did skimp out. Indeed, they put like one scoop on, maybe, if I had to guess, I'd say around four ounces, maybe, I don't know. I don't really know how to measure that, but anyways, they did kind of skimp out until I asked them for the extra protein. But this is what we got here today. It's the standard bowl got this to go of course so here we go lovely weather today you know summer's finally over all right here we go we got the bowl right here in all its glory let's get a quick thumbnail Alright, here we go. Going in. I've had mixed experiences going to Chipotle in the past. It seems really like it varies location by location. Some locations are just straight garbage, while others are actually pretty good. That seems to be the case with a lot of chains, especially fast food ones. You know, my first impressions, I would say, are fairly strong in terms of the quality. No, they'd better be. Okay, this was 15 bucks, which is very steep for what you're getting, but I would say it's, for the most part, of acceptable quality. It's even slightly above average. The rice is well cooked. It's not crunchy. It's not... Not overcooked. It's just right. It's well seasoned. The corn is also seasoned. Adds a nice touch. The cheese is fresh. All the ingredients are fresh. Okay. I got some hot sauce on this too. The hot sauce is kind of kind of good, honestly. It slaps. It's got a nice kick. Good flavor. Let's try the. Let's get a nice good bite of this chicken here. Chicken's okay. It's not bad. Not great. Kind of middle of the road. I'd give the chicken itself like like a like a nine on a scale of two to thirteen. But as for this overall package, you have to take a couple things into consideration whenever you're coming up with the verdict. 
you have to take into consideration the customer service, the quality of the food, how fast it was given to you, the price. To rate the overall experience. Now, just to rate the bowl, you only have to take the quality of the food to account in addition to the price. So, how would I rate the bowl? Well, like I said, it's it's a slightly above average in terms of quality. The bowl is pretty full. They did skimp out on the protein, unfortunately. The rumors are true. I can confirm that. You have the upper management to blame, I would say, for that, but, but anyway. It's above average quality. In terms of quality, I would give this bowl a solid 11.5 on a scale of 2 to 13. You know, it's really not bad. It's rather enjoyable. However, the price is really... It's really what makes me hesitant to recommend this. Now this bowl, without the extra protein, was about 11 bucks. Adding the extra protein was about three, and the, the extra dollar was the tax. But, so, I mean, if you don't get extra protein, they're gonna skip out. You just have to expect that, really. It's, it's the norm here. But, taking that into consideration, I would give the price a rating of, I would give it, I would say the price is a bit below satisfactory, so I would give the price like a 7 on a scale of 2 to 13, it's really just, excuse me, <clears throat> it's really too expensive for what you're getting here. For $15 you could go to a nice restaurant, you know, but here we are going to Chipotle. <clears throat> Chipotle. Uh, so, factoring those two things together, together, <clears throat> we got a seven and an eleven point five. Averaging the two, that's about uh, like a like a nine, solid nine on a scale of two to thirteen. Now, the customer service was surprisingly superb. I got my food in like two minutes. Okay. It's just great. The cleanliness of the place was good, but you know, that varies location by location. So, you really just have to know your local Chipotle in order to deliver a verdict for that yourself. Although, I guess the same can be said for the quality of the food. All right. You know, I'd say overall my experience today taking the customer service into account was a solid 10 on a scale of 2 to 13. And would I recommend this bowl? I would say if you're willing to skimp out on the protein, then yes, I would recommend it. For $11, it's not bad, right? Not bad at all, but the protein, it, it's pretty important. You know, it's an essential part of the meal. And to skimp out on that, it's a deal breaker for some, but for others, not so much. So, would I recommend this? I would say it depends on your tastes and your preferences. But overall, I would say that my experience was positive. Alright, well, that's all I've got for you today, ladies and gentlemen. Today, we were reviewing the bowl from Chipotle. Thanks for joining me today, and see you next time on Lou's Food Reviews.